Hello and welcome to BP Survival once again. So today we just, well, you will see me building this in this video and after that is done we will continue with the survival part. Currently I'm in creative because I was helping people but don't worry, it was building survival with the help of shop, so yeah. Anyways, I put on the smooth shadows on because I don't know, I just, I'm used to my old Minecraft PC back in 2010 that I had everything off and I used to be playing PvP servers, so yeah, I had everything, every effect on for the maximum performance, but honestly, as you can see, I don't need to have because I have around 120 FPS, that's FPS of my monitor, so yeah, I actually have 144 Hz monitor, but uh, I don't have option to use that, so it's weird, so I just use 120, but doesn't matter, it looks pretty much the same to me, so let's begin building this stuff.
So it looks like, oh, I was stuck on the glass. Uh, the building, the factory is finally done. It took a little bit of time and a bit of money. Well, for you, that was a few minutes of time because if you were watching, you were watching sped up footage, of course. And there's somewhere in the infernal around here that is causing my... Oh, oh that's... Oh, oh, oh. Hello, skeleton. Can you get stuck? Oh god, oh, no, 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 no. Are you infernal? No. Oh, uh, I don't have adequate armor. Oh, he's still alive, he's still alive. Oh, 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 no, no, no. There's a wither. And... Will I kill him or will I die? Where is he? Come on, come on. <sighs> oh, actually, I got the merman helm. That's actually... Hold on, hold on. Oh, we got drawn boots and a merman helm. Because most of the time when Infernal explodes like that, the loot is destroyed and people get like, Oh, I killed this guy and where is my loot? Well, the Infernal just, you know, blows up your loot. Why were you playing with TNT? No, it, yeah, I wasn't playing with TNT, it was Infernal. Anyways, what do I want to do today? Um, hmm, where did we left off? So we created a grappling hook. Oh, which should now work as intended. Yep, it stays in, in your inventory since the last or last two restarts or anywhere. And yeah, as you can see now, when you use it, it stays in your inventory. Oh, sorry wasn't planned and someone started uh, building a huge nothing here I don't know like someone started digging this out and the other players joined and now we have a huge hole which honestly I think it would suit for a nice some kind of water village or maybe a dock for ships so you know there's that so we might build something and let's see grappling hook and let's see hello yeah, you can fly with this thing. Depends. I'm gonna give to this guy funny stuff. Here. I have this fun stuff. And he is happy, I guess. Come on, try and use it. I want to see. Come on. The audience is waiting to see other guys fly out. And oh, looks like someone has built a house near us. Oh, you don't have the knowledge. Oh. So, what do you do? Yeah. Keep the grappling move, because why the hell not? One day you'll know how to use it, and it's really fun. So, where do we left off? So, I built the basement, and I built the upper floor, and I decorated things a bit. And yeah, let's see. Oh, there's dirt. Okay, we don't want dirt there. Do we have uh, oh, we have bricks? Okay, amazing. <laughs> go kill something. Yeah, go hunt, go kill mobs, go uh, do whatever. Yeah, uh, oh, you see, I should make raid. Uh, how do you call it? A player warp if I haven't yet to my mob farm so others can use it. Oh, Forest Town, what? Green Pasta, who? What? Forest Town, oh, he created a public village warp. Hmm, yeah, that can't go wrong. Like, look, I we don't enforce griefing, but if the guy hasn't claimed this. I wish him best of the luck. Or just because I'm admin. Oh, right. Aha! Yeah, that makes sense. So I. Hmm. I don't know why did he create a warp, but that's okay. Since you can't get out of the house if you don't have permission, which I did because, you know, I'm an admin and I can bypass the climbs. For the good purposes, like, you know, if I need to see if someone duped items or stuff like that. But anyways, this is a nice village because like house, 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 it's pretty straightforward. House, 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 like it's uh, straight. 
there's no like wee I mean you can see how it's there but it looks like it doesn't go much to the sides like the villagers like to do like yeah it doesn't spread out much so instead of jumping around the categories in slam fun I decided we will be category by category so let's go weapons first so grandma's walking stick we did it grandma's walking stick knockback 5 well that's the same item but upgraded as you can see so you can throw mobs far away and eventually I'm playing actually like I'm planning not playing to maybe introduce a mini game like king of the hill where players will you know have to fight for the to be king of the hill and of course the rewards will be distributed to players since we actually have king of the hill gear which came with uh, one of the packs and i think people could use it so sword of beheading i think this is self-explanatory blade of vampires 26 levels holy hell well let's get to grinding i guess it's funny how i got limited by my own uh not knowledge because i need to increase this because 10 characters for a player warp is really low but i made a warp skeleton spawners so others can access it so this is my skeleton spawner which we will grind xp so i won't record this but most of the game or most of the time will be waiting for skeletons to spawn and then killing them amazing you know, just amazing gameplay. And let's see how much uh, XP we get from this. Well, we got two levels, I guess it's doable. So yeah, let's continue. Apparently there is a mob farm in our town that I'm not aware of, so... I'll let Billy Boy show me the farm, so let's see where he teleports me. Okay, and I guess this is his house, which is on the hill. Oh, hello, okay, okay, okay. I'm following. Well, I'm not following. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm playing survival, my dude. I can't fly, I don't have Elytra yet. I didn't vote for my own server because, yeah. I had other stuff, so I guess it's this way. I'll just TP to you again, so yeah. Okay, so we got teleported. Oh, okay, the... But wait, wait, wait. How is this XP farm? I need to know that because I, all I see is hopper and... Yeah, mobs doing... What is this? How did I not know about this? Holy hell! That's a huge build. And I need to sneeze, so excuse me. <coughs> Sorry about that. What is that? That's amazing. I'm a man of few words. I just know to say, oh, that was amazing, and wow, and... How did I not know about this? Is this maybe an XP farm? Because I need XP farm, I don't need items, I just need simple XP. Yeah. Oh, there's the creeper, and that's my XP. Wow. I think my skeleton spawner was... Hold up, what was that? Skeleton spawner was better. Or I might be wrong, look how many people are spawning suddenly. And again, nothing is spawning. Maybe I need to wait a little because, you know, a mob spawner should spawn stuff like mob spawning is enabled and is limited to normal Minecraft spawning, so shouldn't be set to lower. And hmm, that's a hazard. The skeleton could shut me off theoretically looking from there. But, anyways, let's grind XP. Woo! Honestly, when I think about it, like, this is a good way to grind, you know, not only XP, but... Actually nothing, because everything is going into their hoppers, so they're the one earning from my work. And I hear phantoms, great. Oh, and we got Infernal Zombie coming up, I think. 
Those are the kids. We don't want kids. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, oh. Okay. And a pearl. Come on. Come on. Oof, oof, oof. That, that's a lot of damage. I almost met my dad by the creeper because I was typing and he just, you know, flung me back here. So, lucky me, I guess. Well, Billy just fell down, I guess. I can't really see him, so I must guess he's flying. Come on, XP, we need XP, we need XP, we need how much levels? 26 levels, 26 levels, okay, 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 okay. Okay, we unlocked or have 26 levels, so let's unlock the Blade of Vampires. Let's see this item of gods. Fire Aspect 2, Sharpness 2, Unbreaking 4, Lifesteal 1. Everything you attack something every time you attack something you have 44 chance to recover two hearts of your health. That's actually pretty good and I guess we uh, can make that. <sighs> if we you know grind the wither schools. Oh well let's go and create a nether farm. Well actually you know what? I'm gonna leave that for another episode, but yeah, we unlocked one recipe. No Billy, watch out Billy, zombie behind your back. And he's dead. Oh no 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 water 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 water. <laughs> Ew, that was close. Okay, I changed my plan for this episode. Let's make a click uh, slime find item. So let's make portable crafter and portable dustbin. We just need to wait for animation to unlock. Okay, we have unlocked portable crafter. Yay! And portable dustbin. What do we need? We need book and crafting table. That's easy to create. Hopefully. Let's try. So we need book and crafting table and we have a crafting table on the go. Come on. So book. Do we have book? We have slime fan guide. No, no. <sighs> we don't have book. Now how do you make books? So we need, I guess, sugar cane and we need leather, right? Let's do this fast. So this, like that, and bam. And we need crafting table and we need to course we need to put it in here and okay that's not it so book on the left side and a crafting table and we made portable crafter amazing we can now craft on the go and let's see portable dustbin what do we need for dustbin we need just eight iron ingots okay let's do that we have seven <sighs> let's our use quickly our shop let's buy Eight, I don't care, and let's create our portable dustbin. And you might be wondering, what does the dustbin do? Well, it simply deletes the items you don't need. Such a useful item. I mean, it's pretty cool. Nope. Yeah, great. Uh, other stuff, rack and bandages, I guess you can see what they do. It extinguishes fire and restores HP. Splint just restores HP. Vitamins restore HP, extinguish fire and cures poison with or radiation. And medicine does the same, I think. Yeah. But I think the other is. Oh, uh huh. It's pretty hard to make. But we won't use it right now because we don't need. When I will go hunt the withers, we will use it. Actually, we can uh, unlock small backpacks, so we don't have enough XP. I'm blind, I thought it said, and um, like, you know, 12 levels. I'll be right back. Uh, you have interesting flora and fauna here. You have a chicken and a cow inside your walls, if you didn't notice. I don't know how did those guys get here, and, but yeah. And you have a hole in your wall. That actually rhymes. Yeah, I'm interesting. And we're back here again. So let's get that bread. Or in this case, XP. Oh, hello, hello, what is that? Who is angels? Skeleton? Okay, go die, go die, please go die. I don't want few levels, I don't need to die. You need to die. Okay, he's dead. And cue up the amazing music, uh, movies, whatever you use, 
we are unlocking the small backpack. Now, what do you backpacks do? You might be wondering. Well, you would never guess. Oh, it unlocks all backpacks. Amazing. So we need basic items and gold six carat. <sighs> Let's get to work. And here we are back again. So we make how to make we make gold carrot with gold dust. And how to make gold dust again in ore crusher and where is our ore crusher? Um, how do you make ore crusher? Uh, I'm gonna I need to create machines and just leave them ex you know leave them be. Don't dismantle them. That's why I created this factory so I don't have to do this every single time when I want to craft something. I might have found an oversight on slime fun plugins. So for example, to get a gold dust we need gold ore. But to get gold ore you need to be very lucky to get silk touch pickaxe because I don't think you can craft gold ore, right? So yeah, I'm gonna just replace my 51 ingots with gold ore. Hope you don't mind because you know I don't have a silk touch pickaxe yet. So yeah, it's like magic, you see nothing, you see a portable dustbin, gold ingot, gone, doesn't exist. And let's get crafting our gold ore, I guess. Okay, we have 30, 42, and we wanted to make gold ingot 6 carats, so we need now ingots that I just sold. <sighs> ah. I'm gonna kill myself. You know, there's one simple issue with slime fun, and you might be wondering, oh, what it is? Well, it's pretty simple, you know, like on modern Minecraft, oh, you get, how do you call it? Did I just quit? No, we don't need that. You have custom, uh, custom items. So you can see which item is which and here you just need to read the names and try to remember what you are doing which from one side it's interesting but from other side it's pretty confusing like maybe they could create some kind of custom items with heads like you know for portable crafter and portable dustbin but again slime fun is like 50 developers so you know it's hard to create something when there's a lot of stuff. So we need, again, gold dust to create in smeltery. Okay, and to get a gold dust, we need this. Okay. And we fire up the smeltery. Uh, we go gold ingot and this. And we create gold ingot 6 carat. Okay, so we got that, and now what do we need for backpack? Leather and chest. Let's do this quickly and end this video because honestly I'm a bit sleepy because I was... Since when is leather used for world guard regions? Please tell me someone. Anyways, since I was in the gym so I'm a bit tired so let's just do this quickly and we will be on our way for today. And we got a small backpack and now we can store our items here. Hooray! And so if you drop it, it looks like a backpack and you can, I guess, give it to someone. But I'm not sure if they they will be able to open it since, you know, they don't have slime from backpack opened. But yeah, we got a backpack. Amazing. Portable dustbin and portable crafter for today and a lot of headaches. But that would be it guys, thank you for watching, like, share, subscribe, do whatever you do best, I don't care, it's up to you, and see you guys next time, bye!